Well, she's not standing by her man. Today, a local woman took the stand in a murder case and testified against the accused killer, her husband. He's accused of stabbing a neighbor to death at the Somerset Apartments in Troy. Priya Mann was in court for today's big twist. Good evening, Priya. The most explosive testimony came from the defendant's wife, who says her husband told her to clean a kitchen knife with bleach after telling her he'd killed two people. He said a man put up a struggle. He said a woman didn't. And he said, I might have left some DNA on her. Charles Steffens is accused of killing his neighbor, 37 year old Kalpana Morali Babu. The mother of two was stabbed repeatedly and her throat was cut. I remember seeing a, a big old knife being pulled up out of his jacket and he tossed it on the bed. And, and it, it wasn't no blood, nothing on it. Did he and, tell you to do anything? With yes, the knife? he said, oh. take the knife and clean it with bleach. Steffens' wife testified she cleaned the knife and put it back in the kitchen. If I ask you to look at People's Exhibit Number 5, can you tell me by letter which knife it was that you put back in the block? It was A. Knife A? Mm -hmm. Last month, the woman's body was found inside her apartment near Somerset Mall. Steffens lived in the same building and was known to police for theft-related crimes. Police say Steffens stole the woman's distinctive necklace and sold it to a pawn shop. It was 22 carat. It had three charms on it. It was a necklace. And they looked like religious charms. The victim's husband identified the chain as his wife's Mongol Sutra, which is equivalent to a wedding ring. The clerk says she paid Stephens $12.50 for it. During his arrest, police found the victim's jewelry and her Tweety Bird keychain in his pocket. Following his prelim, Stephens had pled no contest to an unrelated charge of embezzlement. He was sentenced to 93 days in jail and will remain behind bars before his trial begins. Reporting from Troy, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. All right, thank you, Priya. Now, the victim had two children under the age of 10. Police say they recovered the kids' PlayStation from Stefan's home.